Yo, welcome back. Welcome back. What is going on, you guys? It is RWRS rolling with the Rolling Stoners. I'm here joined with Stinky Hippie. What's going on, Stinky Hippie? How you feeling today? Good. How you doing? I'm doing good. I'm doing good, man. I'm loving this yellow jacket, though, yo. This is a very uh, festive, like, you know what I'm saying? Coat, like, you know what I mean? Overcoat, ain't it? Like, yeah. 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 Looks, Thank you. Looks nice. Yeah. Appreciate you. No doubt, no doubt. You know I'm gonna saying? get hot in a second, so I'm probably gonna have to uh, <laughs> take, take it off. But <laughs> right now, look good. Look, look Thank good. you. you know Thank you. Saying? Appreciate you. Yeah. So uh, what's going on? Like you know, um, holidays is coming up. Like you know, you prepare for uh, the holidays or so. Um. No, I am not prepared. But um, you know, Very. same thing every year. <laughs> you know, no different. I'm not gonna lie. I personally do gotta do a little bit of late uh, shopping, mm-hmm. so you know, try to get that done. Mm-hmm. Hopefully tomorrow, you know, what I'm saying I know <laughs> things gonna be hectic out there, but like you know, try what to you get gotta do. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so it was good though. Um, you know, we back uh, at it. You know, with some more hot topics and like you know, uh, I'm getting the playlist together soon though for you guys. I know uh, a lot of people hitting me up like, look, man, we got this fire music and everything, like, but. Working out the kinks right now and just got the website uh, popping and everything. So, we will be getting to you guys with the playlist, you know. So, mm-hmm. um, I'm going to go ahead and roll up, mm-hmm. you know, as a, you know, a duty caller. So, you know what I'm saying? So, but uh, what's good with your snakey? Like, you know what I mean? Like, what's up? What's your plans for the holidays? Like, you know. Um. Well, my family is pretty much uh, quarantining. Um, so, <laughs> not yeah, a whole lot. Leave your gifts at the front door on the porch. Right. You know what I'm saying? I'm coming to get the gifts. Like, yeah. Yeah. yeah, so we're not going to do a whole lot on my side of the family. Yeah. Uh, probably just, just some, some gift and drop offs. So, you know, all the nieces and nephews, and mm-hmm. that's about it. What yeah. about you? Uh, I'm not entirely sure. Like, uh,. <laughs> You know, my family is and isn't. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to get anybody in trouble. But, like, you know, like, we're going to enjoy our uh, Christmas. That's all I'll say. Like, you sure. know. But um, you uh, you told me about something dope, though. Uh, you know, about a couple of weeks ago. Um, you got, you're doing, like, a, a, what do you call it? A Secret Santa? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, me you know, and so uh, some of my friends from college, uh, yeah. Dana and Jasmine. Um, but yeah, we decided to just do like, a, I mean, obviously it's not really a super secret Santa because it's only three of us. So <laughs> once you pick somebody, you kind of figure out, you know, but, um, but yeah, we did it. And, um, so I'm excited. It's going to be our first time doing it. That's so, pretty uh, dope. Yeah. yeah. And you guys, uh, and you guys all live in different states though. That's well, the, well, me and Dana right? both live in California, but okay, she lives okay. in Vallejo. So in like Northern Cal and then yeah, yeah Jasmine lives out there in Arizona. Okay. But okay. yeah, man, uh, that's that's actually fly as hell. Mm-hmm. Like you know what I'm saying? Like, mm-hmm. damn, yo, I ain't never thought about that. Mm-hmm. But yo, hey, y'all gonna be seeing some gifts coming soon yeah. next year, though. Like, you know what I'm mean? saying? <laughs> next year, like that, so, so 2021 is our year. year. Yeah, we switch. <laughs> up, you know, so. But uh, do you I, think a lot of people are saying that 2021 is gonna be their year? Man, <laughs> 2020 I think, wasn't. I it. think everybody's a little hesitant to like you know what I'm saying? It's like proclaim it. It's like you. You feel it on the inside, but, like, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? It's like, you don't go on Twitter just yet. Right. Like, saying, like, you know what you I mean? Got so, it. But, like, you got it. But, know, I do feel it, like, I do feel like it is, you know. It is a little key year. It's my motherfucking year, though, you know what I'm saying? Like, I feel you, I feel you. So, uh, we're going to see what's up, though, man. Mm-hmm. But, um, mm-hmm. that kind of leads, me, like, you know, I kind of wanted to talk about, like, uh, the whole Christmas and festive, uh, you know, uh, times and everything. Mm-hmm. You uh, have you ever been Christmas caroling? Do you no. do you believe in Christmas caroling? Do you enjoy Christmas caroling? Have, <laughs> I don't know if have you ever I believe seen it. anybody I mean, come to your house Christmas caroling. Uh, like, what's up? I think if somebody came to my house Christmas caroling, they probably would have got shot. <laughs> like I don't <laughs> think that is something that was ever a thing in South Central. <laughs> like no, nah, yeah. don't. So, so, so you Y'all had carolers at your house? I, I don't recall. Everybody. Okay, that's what I was gonna say. <laughs> Uh, I, I thought you was <laughs> nah, nah. I thought that was just a me thing. No, no, no. Nobody, you nobody you just going around yeah. door to door uh, singing 
Niggas got like jobs and bills to pay. I mean, <laughs> like, you know? I mean, but like you can have uh, you can have Jehovah's Witnesses come like disturb your peace like early in the morning and shit. They ain't gonna and sing they don't to get you. Shot, like you know what I'm saying, but, but like, they not gonna sing. And they don't even yeah. believe in holidays. But what if it's a good Christmas carol? Like you know what I'm saying? Like How boys would... and men came up to your door. Like, what if men ain't going to? Uh, I feel you. Merry like Christmas. <laughs> all in unison. Like you know what I'm saying? That should be hard. Well, that sounds you like mean? nice in a. Uh, in a perfect, uh, in a perfect world, <laughs> but uh, right. in the world that I grew up in, that's sh- that's just not happening. But <laughs> I agree, I agree. It's nice in theory. That's that's what I think too. I'm like, ah, but I at the same time, it, yeah, but... I think if somebody, like, if a group of carolers came up to our door now, it's like if they weren't good, then like, do you just politely close the door on their face, or well, do you just stand there even, and just it's endure? Even it? Worse though, because it's like it's COVID now, so it's like especially if you ain't good, right. bro, like, yo, like yeah, I'm just I'm, I'm calling police. <laughs> like, <laughs> motherfuckers gonna report your ass, bro. Like, nah, um, but like that. What What about um your favorite Christmas song? What What's your favorite or like that one song you hear that gets you like, okay, yeah, Christmas is coming. Or it's really uh, time for Mariah Carey. Uh, what's Mariah? What's that song called? Uh, all alone, all alone for Christmas. Okay. Did you know that's a Mariah Carey original? Really? She wrote All the one for Christmas? She wrote that. Oh. And if, she if recorded. Is, I don't know. Like, I'm not even about I'm, to. No, it I, I looked it up. That's it is crazy. a Mariah Carey original. That's why every year when she, like, people redo that song, she yeah. gets so much royalty. That's why she pushes so hard for Christmas. She Cause that's all her. Your money. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mariah Carey, All the One for Christmas. All right. Mine's is like, uh, it's, um, it's on the Temptations and. Smokey Robinson album. <laughs> really? Yeah, 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 man. So my dad used to bump this every year. So okay. uh, this like these couple of albums, like, you know, you knew it was Christmas time once you heard So like I don't know. It's just uh I can't think of the name, exact name, but like I gotta look it up now. Oh go tell them on the mountain. They did that. <laughs> Yeah, man, but uh, I don't know, man. Every time I heard that album, I'm like, okay. I mean, Christmas I need to time. go back and listen to that album. I don't think I've ever heard it. Yeah, yeah, no. Nah, Temptations was actually fire, like you know, like the Temptations I, Christmas album. I've yeah. heard that uh, Boys to Men Christmas album. And yo, yeah, they did have a hard uh, Christmas album. That was album. good, but like I like a lot of Christmas albums. Like yeah. Ariana Grande has a good one. Um, or her little EP. Um, yeah. Ashanti has one. Yeah. Destiny's Child, of course, is a nice classic. Okay, okay. Um, yeah. Okay, I'm, a, I'm a Christmas music I still think, uh, Chris Brown. <laughs> Chris Brown. <laughs> uh, what's the name? Uh, in this the Christmas? Movie, this, oh, he did. Yeah, this Christmas. Yeah. yeah. That, I think, still is mm-hmm. by far one of the best. This covers. Christmas, and then what was the other song, too, that he did? Uh... The same, uh, it's on the same, sure. whatchamacallit. Oh, I man. Sure. Man, but I don't know if y'all see me right now rolling up on these beautiful, luxurious, uh, luxurious uh, trays. Luxurious. Try a little tenderness. Oh, yeah, yeah, a little bit of tenderness. Yeah. yeah. Um, I just, wait, a little tenderness? Try a little tenderness. Try, I just, I just made yeah. my own little bit of tenderness. <laughs> <laughs> Try a little tenderness. Yeah, yeah that was hard work. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt you. No, no, no. I mean, this is your product, y'all. Oh, you talking about uh, (laughs) these lovely ashtrays right here? You know what I'm saying? I see. But anyway, yeah, man. I'm rolling up (laughs) on these uh, luxurious uh, rolling trays right now. Mm -hmm. Stinky trinkets. Stinky trinkets. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. (laughs) Rolling trays. You know what I'm saying? Also, we have the ashtray right here. You know what I'm saying? So, you can go ahead and pre-order yours right now. You sure can. Holidays. Mm -hmm. Get them going. I mean, so. You can customize them or you can buy them as is. Just Mm -hmm. let me know. Stinky. Mm -hmm. S-T-I-N-K-I-E. Trinkets. T-R-I-N-K-E-T-S. On Instagram. And more places coming soon. (laughs) (laughs) Right, right, right. You know what I'm saying? We're about to get the website and everything popping. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. All that, all that. We're going to go ahead and uh, say our mantra. I'm going to say the mantra before mm. we go ahead and jump into it. You know, so uh, everybody, I hope you got yours ready. You know what I'm saying? For the fire up. But we didn't take this smoke, not to abuse, but to heal the body, elevate the mind, uplift, and enlighten the soul and spirit. Fill mind and heart. Yeah, now with that being said, let's go ahead and fire up this, man. Uh, shout out to um, 
to the right bros. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? For like, you know, keeping your boy uh, you know, always stocked up, you know what I'm saying, you know, elevated, you know. So appreciate y'all. Go ahead, fuck that real quick, bro. thought about it 2020 has been so um unpredictable and weird and like i don't even know what is going to happen like especially with covid it's just hard to yeah predict right yeah um i guess personal goals just to continue to i don't know i want to say some cliche shit like (laughs) be the better version of me i don't know Right, it's hard to even believe in like New Year's resolutions too, because it's like year in and year out, you be hearing people be like, "Oh yeah, man, I got this going on, and I'm gonna do this." Like you know, two weeks in the gym, like you know, looking right, good, right. And then it's like, man, you know what? Fuck that, man. Rallies is calling right now, bro. Like you know, <laughs> like oh man, not nah, uh, Hawkins burgers is calling right now. I don't man. know if y'all uh, have not had Hawkins. And if you live in the Los the, Angeles uh, area, promo. yeah, but if you in Los Angeles, go to the Hawkins, bro. Delicious. It's oh, gonna take about an hour for your God. food to be ready, and that's how you know it's good. <laughs> you know it's worth yeah. it. <laughs> that's how you know it's good. You it is worth it. Five. I ain't gonna lie though. We went to a uh, Burger King the other day, and I hadn't been to Burger King in years, and that was one of the best burgers I've had in a good while. <laughs> like it, it was really smacking. Man, you know what though, man? I, I think. I hate to say it though, man. Cali food is like you know top I think tier, top tier. Like you know what I'm saying, like top tier. I think Cali is top tier. What what other places you think is top tier? Like you know, like states wise. Yeah, I heard Texas is really good. Like Texas. I heard Texas has really okay. amazing food. Obviously, like Atlanta. And I, I know that's just Atlanta. I don't know about like yeah, outside well, of Atlanta, but like I know. I always hear about New Orleans. New Orleans, yeah, is, like, you know their saying? food is like you can go to Popeyes in New Orleans, and it's just. Yeah. It's just smacking. <laughs> it's just it's a totally Do different yet, experience. Like, yeah, oh, man. that is, yeah. Mm. That was also good back then. It's a, it's a, what else? Um, what do you think they have in like New York? You think they have good food, or you think? Yeah, it's just... well, I thought they were. Isn't New York known for their pizzas? Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, I feel like <laughs> New York is really good for, like, ethnic food. Never never been to New York. Like, so Jamaican like, food I, or, like, Ethiopian yeah, food because yeah, it's a lot of, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. that's what I would imagine, but. Mm-hmm. And they say Chicago know. is, like, you know, they got their hot dogs. Right. And, like, and they deep know, dishes. Like, the deep dishes and stuff like that. So, it's like, you know, places are known for their stuff, but, like, I don't know, California, though. That's different. All around, dog. You know what I'm saying? You ain't going to find no Mexican food that touches uh, California Mexican food. At all. At all. Mm-hmm. But I am still like, you know, uh I'm a young talented <laughs> guy. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Unexperienced, <laughs> like to all many of the, you know, food uh groups out there. So like, you know, we'll see like how I feel when I when we start traveling and shit opens back up, you know what I mean? So, you know what's interesting? So yeah. I was on Twitter the other day. And um, I read that I wanted, th- I think it was like Montana or one of those like flyover states where they find it a delicacy to eat like raw ground nope. beef sandwiches. Nope. nope, not going there. Nope. They eat raw meat <laughs> sandwiches and like they get it from like a butcher and they legit just don't even cook it a little bit like bread, the raw meat, like raw ground beef and yeah. then like, I don't know, pickles, yeah. mustard. Yeah. No, <laughs> no, I need to cook. Uh, no, nope. can't do it. Like, I, I don't even want a rare steak. Like, yeah, I, I barely like medium. It, I don't even like I don't, it. I don't like the blood on medium rare, so I think it's like medium done rare. So there's like, medium um, rare, and then there's medium, <laughs> and then medium well. Medium well, okay. Or I, or medium school too, as long as medium I ain't no, cool. like, you know, blood leaking out. Like, I'm like, come on, man. Come on. 
<laughs> don't do this to me, man. Don't do me like that. You know what I mean? And then the cookies, <laughs> the cookies are all upset, too. Like, man, I guess it's just what you said, bro. But I didn't know. So, I mean, like, how? okay, so, like, realistically, right? Like, I got, what, 15000 on the table right now? You eating the raw meat sandwich? You got to eat the whole thing. I ain't talking about take a bite. I'm talking, like, you got to eat the whole thing. Yeah. And I, I'll dress it up for you. Hell yeah, I eat it. Oh, you gross. <laughs> you nasty. That, that, that was my starting off point, and I think that you nasty. I was willing, <laughs> to, I was willing to, to go up. Raw, mm-hmm. like, uh, mm-hmm. a raw sandwich? Nah, you gross. <laughs> yeah, man. What? Yeah. 15,000, But you're going to die. Got, you're going to have salad vanilla and all kinds of... Uh, That's a risk. You ain't you never going to... 15,000 like, ain't enough. Look, all I'm saying is like, okay, I eat that, and I'm going to have to take the craziest shit of my life. Like, you know what I'm saying? Or and throw it all 15, up. I still got 15,000. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, you know, I'll walk away with that. I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think, man. Like fifteen thousand on the table right now to eat a raw meat sandwich. Now and this this is like just like the meat sandwich that they talking about, like it's fresh. Yeah, fresh like yeah. Let me see if <laughs> yeah, I can I'm find not, a picture I'm not of this. Eating that for eleven ninety five? Hell no. <laughs> Fuck no. But I mean, these people pay to eat it. Like. Oh yeah, true. Yeah. Still wouldn't like if I was getting paid that price. Like, hell no. Yeah, where was that? You said Montana. I don't know. I believe this one. Oh, Wisconsin. Wisconsin. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> but, you know, to each his own. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, nah, man. Keep that in Wisconsin. To each his own, you feel me? They say they got the... Nah, like this. Like, but, hold on. Actually. Oh. It was so ugly. And then two patties. You really, you, you chowing that down like this? <laughs> it's going to be a That's struggle. That's what you're doing? But yo, you put fifteen thousand on the uh, <laughs> on the table, though. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Like eating eating something. You like, can't put cheese on it. Huh? You can't put cheese on it. <laughs> no cheese, like you know what I'm saying. <coughs> oh man. Oh, that's you get onions that. and pickles, and that's it. Onions and pickles. Oh man. Oh. All right. Well, let us know what uh, you would do be because. Rough. Uh, be rough. But yeah, I think I still. I'm would not. Do you wouldn't do it. Not for fifteen thousand now. I don't that's, think so. All right, that's, that's a lot of money. What if we go to a, a, a full honey? Well, definitely. Six figures. Full honey? Yeah. And you got to eat it without the bun, the onions, and the uh, pickles. So I'm just eating raw meat? Just straight raw. <laughs> a, ball, <laughs> a ball of raw meat. Ooh. For a honey cake. That sounds disgusting. <laughs> I mean, if I could get it down, I'll, right. I'll, I'll, I'll at least attempt for a hundred thousand. <laughs> what? Nah, Pay I'll make the money. attempt. Pay me my money. But see, I would be mad if I attempted and then I couldn't finish it. Yeah, I was like, oh no, you don't get it. <laughs> Somebody got to die. <laughs> that's the worst. Like, <laughs> that's that. That's like fear factor. You, got, you know, like you didn't already you ate like. <laughs> Telling me I ate two goat's balls and I don't get the million dollars? No. <laughs> no. Three quarters of the way. You got to finish the whole thing. Oh, man. I'm sorry. I know I'm caught. <coughs> man, that's crazy, though. It's like thinking about that, man. You only ate half of it or a quarter. Uh, you know what I'm saying? It's just like you I want already a quarter of my prize. dying inside eating this shit. <laughs> and you don't make it to the end. Like, oh. Yeah, that that's hurtful right there. Yeah. <laughs> that's funny as fuck. You uh, so what's good? Do you have uh any um any uh new hot topics uh um, you want to share today? Let's see, let's see, let's see. I got one, but oh. like, this, this is a little explicit now. You know, I want to wait. So before we do that, yeah. you want to talk about something light? Yeah, yeah. Okay, sure. so let's kind of take it back. Okay. A couple weeks, okay? Take it back. So we watched the Undoing. Should we talk about it? Let's talk about it. How did you feel about it? The Undoing is this show on, what was it, HBO? No, it's on uh, Netflix, I believe. I think, I'm pretty sure. Damn. I think it's on Yo, HBO. Yo, The Undoing, y'all let us know what it's on. I'm pretty sure it was Netflix. She says it's HBO. Uh, um, but um, if you haven't seen it, so HBO, we don't, right? don't got to do it this time because it's been out for a while, right? Like, what? It's like, we ain't got to do like a... Uh, I hope not. I well, I don't think we if you have not seen it, then go ahead and skip yeah, like 10 yeah. minutes. <laughs> Yeah, do, do what you got to do, you know what I'm saying? Smoke one, like, you know. Go and then come back to something, it. Come back to it, yeah. 
All right, so the undoing. You want to break it down? The undoing. Okay. From my recollection, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. This is a, she is a therapist, psychologist? Mm-hmm. Therapist, right? Mm-hmm. She's married to this uh, very successful, are they in London? Are they in, like? No, they live in America. So, okay. He's British. He's, he's British. Okay. She, she's uh, married to a very successful uh, British guy. Uh they have a child and everything, and they're mm-hmm. living a very, uh, you know, um, I don't know, wholesome, rich, uh, nice. rich, yeah, nice, uh, Caucasian not lifestyle, wholesome, yeah, hell no, nah, yeah, rich, uh, privileged life uh, mm-hmm. in New York, mm-hmm. and so it starts off with this mysterious girl coming to a group meeting with the uh, of the wife and the school yeah, it was a, moms. Like all it was, moms a, it was like a PTA. Like yeah, the moms. Yeah, the city, the city. Yeah. Okay, PTA. And so she was like a new mom. Um, a new her, mom. S- her son was just enrolled into the school, but it was kind of weird because it was a, a private school, so it was really expensive nah, to get in. weird was when she popped out her titty. <laughs> <laughs> like, yo, that's, that's what was weird. She popped her titty out, like, you know what I'm saying, first, like, like 15 did. minutes and shit. You know? but, but yeah, because uh, they were looking at her like, right. Who is she like? Yeah, I'm trying to I'm trying to do a quick uh all right. So anyway, yeah. so this okay, this, this uh new new uh female came in, right? Y'all excuse my uh my terminology, but like y'all just bear with me. Uh new chick came in. She was trying to get all involved with the PTA meetings and like, you know, the moms around the city and everything, right? Uh come to find out or or so like, you know, later on in the episodes, kinda early on, uh she ends up dying. Mysteriously, like it was a brutal death. It was fucked up. Like you know, I don't want to like you know talk about it, but like go watch. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so now they're trying to figure out like how the fuck did she die and like who the fuck did she know? So like you know the show is breaking down like you know the different connections of who she talked to, and like during this uh PTA meeting, she kept popping up on the rich British guy's wife. Like you know the main character. She she kept popping up on the wife. Like you know. It was just like kind of weird, like how they had this random dynamic, like you know, uh, together. Um, and then come to find out, you know, uh, there was an affair with the uh, British guy and the new chick, and like it's a lot, a lot of bu- a bunch of crazy shit going on. You want to take it on, uh, take it from there, like or cause, yeah, like, I feel so like, yeah, like basically, like the show kind of like leads you into believing, like. Maybe this person did it. Maybe that person did it. Well, maybe the wife really did know, and she's pretending like she didn't know. Maybe the husband did it. You know what I'm saying? Like, he was having an affair. Like, you really don't know. Um, Because she was married herself. Maybe her husband did it. You know, maybe maybe their son did it. Maybe he, you know, found out and was trying to put his family back together. Um, Basically, like, it takes you... It was really interesting, like, the build-up. I really enjoyed it, because I like those, like, you know, like... Mm -hmm. uh, those, uh, those What's, uh, mysterious uh, yeah it was suspenseful, suspenseful. exactly yeah. like i like that build up uh personally i thought the ending was shit <laughs> like uh <laughs> i like the logical explanation was like for like the husband to have done it so like i was expecting like a big twist but then the husband did it and it was just like well that's boring and, yeah. like, it was cool how, like, he kept, like, his cool and how he kept lying. And I guess until he was, the very end, until the very, end. very end, like, he maintained, like, his, his lies very well. But, I mean, through and through, again, it was a good show, but yeah. I could have done that with a better ending. I hear you. But, like, I, I, well, I appreciated the ending. The reason why is because sometimes, like, writing gets a little too, like, fucking, like, chaotic and crazy, and it's like... Yeah. That shit wouldn't happen, type shit. But like, I feel like the way they wrote it was like, okay, we knew that's what happened, but like, we didn't want it want that to happen. But that's what would have happened. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's like, yeah. I don't know. It's, it was realistic to me, and that that's why I it appreciated was. it. Yeah. Like, I know it wasn't what I wanted. Like, as a like suspenseful watching, like you know, like you always crave you know some yeah. some crazy stuff to happen. But I was like, okay, I appreciate it for that. Mm. that aspect. Yeah. What's good? What up? What else, man? But I do let us know if uh, what, if y'all like any other shows. Cause I feel yeah, like I'm we about to say yeah. Let us know been, what shows y'all watching or what shows we should watch and like you know kind of talk about like. Cause man, like there's a there's a cartoon man. I don't know. Uh, 
if y'all ever heard about it. It's called Forget About It. That shit is fucking wild as hell, man. So it's about like a a mafia family. So if you like uh like mafia movies, like old mafia movies, like uh, uh Goodfellas, like you know Scarface, uh you know uh, Godfather, all those type of shows. This show is like a comedy cartoon, like spoof on that, and it's one of the funniest shows that I've seen. Like. And it got me through, like, you know, these last couple weeks. Mm-hmm. Like, low-key, man. I'm actually, I had them on repeat, like, low-key, because I went to it. I think it's about three seasons, so it's quick watch. You know what I mean? Y'all go check that out. Uh, yeah, forget about it. Like, you know what I mean? That shit's hilarious. So, yeah, on Hulu. Yeah. <clears throat> so, um, I guess we got some little, I guess, little current events, little hot uh, gossipy shit. Like, you know what I mean? Um, oh, what? Where? Yeah, like, you know, have you heard about uh, Rajon Rondo's girlfriend? Oh, she beat like, up that girl? Yeah, getting fist saw, did you the see girl. the video? Yeah, I saw the video, man. I'm like, yo, she's yeah, lucky, I mean, <laughs> she lucky putting hands on her. Like, I but like, I mean, oh, like, Rajon Rondo was trying to stop it. The he girl did, yeah. was like, clearly. He was like, look, he, I, he stopped it at from, first. He was like, look, from what I saw, okay. like, she either spit on that him or she said something and was like, all right. Hey, he took the chain off her dog. <laughs> like, yo, he was like, yo, he took the. <laughs> he let the dog off her on her ass, man. Like, oh man, that shit was crazy. I don't she, like that metaphor, took, but I feel you though. I feel. You. Oh man, yo, you know sometimes everybody when you get into that mode, like you mm-hmm. know, the dog, like, savage. I, like, I feel you. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. So, uh, yeah. like it was, uh, it was called for though. Uh, it looked like I don't know what was said. Like you know what I'm saying? We don't know. We didn't hear the audio. Um, but yeah, what y'all think about that? Like you know what I'm saying? Right or wrong? <laughs> not even I'm not saying that it was right for her to get her ass beat I'm just saying it was right for, for her to have the fair fight that she obviously wanted you know what I mean yeah, like hey, the were, fact that she got were, her ass beat was just uh, it looked like they were trying to chill that's what from watching the video it looked like they were trying to resolve it mm-hmm, with words mm-hmm. at first and uh, the um, I don't want to say victim the person that was struck <laughs> struck <laughs> right. she like definitely um, instigated or like you know very, mm-hmm. like very much so like pressed up on the the person so right. I don't know I think it was cause for so we don't we don't know what's good uh, stinky hippie you got any other topics or before I get into this uh, last topic or mm, you all good. I had some. Uh, what do you? I had questions to talk about. Okay, it. yeah, yeah, yeah. We can, we can. Um, all right. So let, let's jump into this topic real quick. Let's get this out the way, and then we can go ahead and uh, we'll jump to the uh, would you rather's because I, I I really do like that little segment. So, um, this this topic right here, man. This is kind of what what what's the term I'm looking for? Is it X rated? Like, or is it's it's not for the faint of heart. Faint of heart, like you know, the Puritans out there, like you know what I'm saying. Porn. <laughs> <laughs> Pornos, man, like um, you know, watching pornos. Who calls porn. them pornos? I don't know. I don't know. Dude. Yeah, nobody says pornos. <laughs> Perverts. <laughs> that's who calls them pornos. <laughs> <laughs> Perverts. Man, man. Like, yeah, that's hilarious. Uh, no, no, no. Okay, porn. To me, seems like is like becoming very much more dull. Like you know, what I mean, it's not as exciting as it used to be. And I know they are doing like you know restrictions because, like you know, there's some crazy shit out there. It's just like yeah. And now, like I feel like they've gotten so restricted that it is it's I don't know, man. I'm not enjoying porn like I used you know to, what like, I think it saying? is. What, 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 what I think is? they like. They trying to make their money, so like they're reserving all the good stuff for all the premium content. They want you to pay for it. They're purposely making it all, so that you can have incentive to pay for the good stuff. Yeah. Not only that, but everybody is also moving to OnlyFans. You know, like that's yeah, the true. new movement. Like everybody is. So you think they pulling some of the uh, the uh, I don't know, producers, or you know, you think they pulling a. Content and putting it on OnlyFans or something, or like 
Because, like, even, like... Um, no, like, I think they're putting it in the <coughs> premium content, like, where you're like, oh, yeah, you got to pay for this one. Like, oh, okay. yeah, this is really... Like, this looks good. Like, well, you know what I mean? Like... I know this is, like, you know, let's, let's talk about, uh, like, Pornhub. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, when you go into Pornhub, they typically, they'll still show, like, the premium, like, the thumbnail. Like, you know what I mean? You can see it up there, like, what it is. But you, when you click into it, they're like, no, nah, you can't get this video. <laughs> Like, you know what I'm saying? Let me sign up, man. Come on, bro. Come on, sign up, dog. Go ahead, dog. You want to watch it, right? Sign up, man. But, like, usually they have those videos up to where you can still see them and shit like that. I feel like you don't see those videos no more. Like, and I don't know, man. It's just, I don't know. I don't know, man. I'm just saying. I don't know what's going on. I'm getting old and shit now. Like, I, I feel like, so on, you man. remember, like, uh, when, like, your grandpa had like the old like VCRs of like porn. Yeah, yeah. Like I remember the first time like I saw like that was the first time I realized that like my grandfather was a person. I was like, oh, yeah. he watched porn. God, this is was, I wasn't ready. <laughs> I was just like, oh, like, my little young eyes. I was like, no, no, I don't see that. <laughs> oh, but you know man. what I mean. Like he hey, is a person, and so gotta, like, it is what you, it is. I gotta ask you this question: <laughs> How old? Um, or when you yeah, realized grandpa was a person. <laughs> probably right. Uh I was probably maybe like eight. Okay. Like eight or nine. Yep, yep, yep. And I was <laughs> like, oh, okay. Man, I gotta hear y'all stories. Please let us know, man, like when was the first time you discovered like your parent or your like, you know, uh your, uh, your family, your guide, yeah, your uh, guardian, whatever the fuck the term is. That person, like, you discover, like, some crazy shit about them, and it's just like, oh, wow, like, yeah, you, you human. Sweet. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, okay, this is your vice, or this is, like, you know, what you like to do. Like, mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm-hmm. how old were you, and, like, what happened? Please let us know. <clears throat> For me, okay. same thing with my grandfather. I was probably about, like, nine or ten. Um, I don't know what it but, is uh, about grandpa's. Oh uh, yeah, like uh, you know, um, I feel like everybody's a you know a freak or a perv, like pervert. You know what I'm saying? a little bit pervert. You know what I'm saying? A little bit, like you know what I'm saying? It's just about controlling it, you know. But uh, my grandpa, he was always like he was an artist, so he like he always painted and shit like that. So he had like you know his his uh <laughs> for for the family like paintings out there like in the living room and everything. As a kid, you couldn't go into his room. And I just remember, I remember one time he was uh, starting to get sick and everything. Like, you know, he was getting older and, like, couldn't, like, you know, get around as much and everything. And I remember one time he was, like, all the way in the kitchen. So I was like, man, he's going to be in the kitchen for a while. Like, you know, so let me go ahead and check out what's in this room. Like, this motherfucker has never let me go in this room. Like, let me go see what's going on. I open the door. I mean, immediately. Immediately as I open the door, the <laughs> titties all in your face, huh? <laughs> I was like, oh, 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 oh. He said, yo, what you doing? Get, get, get your ass out of here. I was, you know, I'm like, oh, oh, oh. I was like, yo, man, I mean, for real, man. Just like, as soon as I swing the door open, <laughs> you know what's funny it's though I'm having, like I'm thinking probably cause I'm high it's like very mm-hmm. normal for like men to have pictures of like women and like their bodies and stuff like that but mm-hmm. like if a woman had a picture of just like men and like dicks and, like, <laughs> <laughs> that shit would not be cool like <laughs> you are right <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying like, I mean, like, not that I'm not, like, knocking it. Like, nah, definitely, I mean, I like, do you. Either. If like, that's you what you want to like, do, I yeah. fully support you. You like, know, like, like you I know. fully support you. But that's just not a common but, like, thing men, that you men, see. Like, men are truly, they tr- we truly are visual. I ain't going to say we more visual, but, like, we are visual, like, beings. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, yeah, I think just, women are, too. Like, I don't think that's, that's, that's I why. Gonna say more, I ain't going to say more visual, but, like, I know for, for a fact, like, we love to see like yeah. body shapes. We love to see yeah. women's body like. Yeah. So I, you know, I that's why you know majority of men like to look to some are a little more uh, immature with it. But you know. I feel like like I don't know. 
men's like genitals are just more aggressive. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's so childish. <laughs> 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 Website rwrsnetwork.com. So it was good, man. Are we jumping into this? Uh, that is funny. You said you had the uh, rather, oh, yeah, it? but I cannot find a turn there. I'm on one percent, man. Oh, I have been looking. Hold on, looking for her. She about to go get the charger, man. So, look, as I was saying, though, man, we got the new website popping up. Rolling with the Rolling Stoners, it's called rwrsnetwork.com. Please go uh, subscribe, man. Check out the whole uh, network. Like, you know what I mean? The different people that we align with and just uh, making things happen out here in the city. And, then uh, you know, Phoenix as well. Y'all know what it is, man. You know I got to ride for y'all too. Um, so, please go check out I Am Rude Co. You know what I'm saying? Doing their thing out there in Phoenix. Like, you know, with the events. And he got the podcast thing going off on Fleek right now. So, uh, Fleek? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I had to bring that back. Um also, like, you know, he got the music playlist, uh, you know, popping up. And then, okay, she's getting her pants back. And then also, Hustle Yard Media. Please check them out, man. The website is about to come out soon. They doing big things, man, uh, with the comedy game uh, out here in L.A. and Phoenix and uh, other places, man. I believe they had a show out in Atlanta that was dope as well, too. So they might be doing that in Atlanta soon, too. So y'all be uh, on the lookout for Hustle Yard Media and Rollo the Leader. Um, it's good. We got, like we said, Stinky Hippie. Uh, you know, we got the Stinky Trinkets. I'll be having a hard time saying that shit. The N and <laughs> Stinky Trinkets. Like, you know, we got these, though. The ashtrays, man, these are luxurious. Like, you know, they popping. Like, especially if you got, like, a female in the house that smokes. She gonna want, like, you know what I mean? Some, like, you know, rolling trays and ashtrays. That look like these, like you know what I mean. So please go ahead and uh, pre-order yours now. You know, stinky hippie. Hit her up on Instagram. The website coming soon as well. <clears throat> Indeed. Um, who else? Like, what's good? You ready? <laughs> like, I'm trying to like knock yeah. out some of these shoutouts though before we get. Uh, rumor has it apparel, of course. Got to get that out there, man. Please go check out Rumor Has It Apparel. Um, got some new merchandise out there for y'all. The crew necks and hoodies. Now, the old to Compton, uh, they got the off central, off uh, Wilmington, all the cross streets right there, uh, main cross streets in Compton. Please go check that out. Rumor has it apparel. Go support uh, your local savior. You feel me? <laughs> you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Uh, and I think that's about it, you know. You already mentioned Rumble, the Rumble, Inspired so. by Kiki. Inspired by Kiki, you know what I'm saying? That as well. Yo, females. Yo, you got, the, like, we were talking about, we love seeing body shapes, and, like, yo, she has some amazing dresses and, like, you know, um, shapely clothes for females who have nice body shapes, man. We love to see that. So, yo, go please check out Inspired by Kiki as well, you know. And they have the self-love uh, sweatshirts for everybody, too, or the crew necks for oh, yeah, everybody. They, I think, it was, did I wear that last week? Probably not. Uh, no. But, yeah, um, y'all probably saw me post that on Instagram, man. Please go check it out, Rowan. Stoner FP, you know what I mean, uh, on Instagram, and you can see those uh, self love crew necks. Mm-hmm, 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 yeah, mm-hmm. I think I got it all. God damn, I know that was uh, long winded, man. I'm like, we might need to roll one more. Like, she ain't saying nothing but the words. She was good. Like, um, you got another rap? <sighs> this is this is why you. Uh, she mentioned it to me like before too. We need to start buying packs of blunts. Like, you know what I'm saying. Like, buying one or two, like, uh, you know, two packs is, like, that's cool when you want to go, but, like, you got to have, like, a pack.
packed, you know what I'm saying? Especially during this quarantine time, like, you know what I mean? I think that's the way to go from now on. So. <clears throat> Are you ready for some questions? Sure, yes. All right. Let's hit it. My first one is, would you rather your shirts always be two sizes too big or one size too small? Oh, one size too small. I knew that one. Oh, I'm flexing on my phone. Like, I definitely good? knew yeah, the yeah, answer to that one already. Okay, so what What I got to do? I got to uh, lose this gut real quick. I'll do a couple crunches, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, give me this little one size too small. Yeah. Two sizes too small? Nah, nah. Now I feel you. About, I yeah. feel you. I was like, nah, that shit riding mm-hmm. up a little. Like, every time you bend down. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh, look at this. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> you been down no. shit, boy. You, I hope you got on drawers that day, dog. Because if you ain't got on drawers, bro, and you got on the uh, too small t shirt, bro, you ass crack, dog. Oh, bad. Ass oh, crack, bad. That is what people see. And that's a tip for y'all motherfuckers who be free balling all the time and shit, man. And wearing oh. small ass t shirts, bro, like bending over and shit, nigga. That shit ain't cool, nigga. Don't tie your shoes right now, dog. Nah, wait till you get inside, bro. So, really quick, have you seen the video of the guy who is playing the drums um but can't feel that his ass crack is out wait hold on that's a dude he's playing the drums but he can't feel that his ass crack is out i'm trying like to quest what i'm just <laughs> <laughs> i'm just joking the roots man yeah no the roots man but you know anyways i can't find it now but if i find it i'll definitely show you later on if you guys see definitely uh Tag you in the comments or Man. let me know where I'm you can like, find I it. I ain't never heard of such a thing. Oh yeah, no, this is it's a recent video. It just came out oh, and it's been please, circulating. Please, please but I will find it. Okay. I will find it. Okay. Next question: yeah. Would you rather find five dollars on the ground or find all your missing socks? I think all my missing socks. <laughs> I feel like that's more valuable than five dollars. So I agree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now if we said a hundred dollars. Well, yeah, no, Cause even twenty dollars, I'm like, yeah. But like, you know, twenty dollars is just a gram of weed now. Like, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, mm-hmm. it barely. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, I don't know. Like, everybody like, nigga, where the fuck you go? Nigga, like twenty dollars a gram, dog. <laughs> yeah. All right. Hmm. Would you rather have one nipple or three nipples? Think out or right, where where would this third one go? Hmm. Where where in is the it in the middle? Like right in the middle directly? Yeah. I would get I would get or I would, or I, would do one, three. Or I would do three. I would do three. But you don't even know where one would Actually, be. Actually, no, not would one be in the middle or would one be on the side? What do you know? Does okay. it make a difference? But, I don't know, because you know what I would do? Okay. If if I had a third nipple, I would tattoo around that motherfucker. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna do designs and all kind of crazy shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? I might leave and leave like a little uh like do some arrows and shit, like pointing to the shit. Like, <laughs> like you know what I'm saying? But like some nice ass designs and shit. So it takes it away from the third nipple, you know what I'm saying? But, like, you know, you just gotta, you know, say it. But with one nipple though, man, like that's I don't know, that's awkward though, man. Now you gotta explain the story, like yo, what happened? Like you know what I'm saying? We know what happened when a, a third nipple. You don't nipple. even need nipples, dog. <laughs> what are you talking about? You don't even hey. have a biological need for nipples. Hey, I'm not the one that put nipples on me. Like you know what I'm saying? Y'all, y'all mad? <laughs> you trying to ask hey, No. Y'all, y'all we mad at me deep. for having nipples? Like we this? Hey, yo, God, give us some nipples, man. Like, come on, we need these motherfuckers. Every time, yeah, we get slapped, uh, like, you know what I mean? Real fucking sharp and brisk. It stings for fucking 30 minutes. Yeah, yeah, we yeah, we need these nipples that don't, you know what I'm saying, provide life or anything. Yeah, no, we didn't ask for these either, but, you know, we deal with them. We deal with them. <laughs> okay. All right, we're good. What else you got? How many more you got? Um, let's let's do about like two, three, two, three more. All right. Two more. Three. Yeah, three's a good number. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Oh God, bro. All right, all right, all right. 
broken and I'm broken up for Savior. Would you rather? Okay, I'm just <laughs> This is stupid. What's up? Would you rather blink at twice the normal rate or not blink at all for five minutes? <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, what do you mean? Like blink like hella like fast? Every, like every five minutes you think you blink. Like, no, I, I get that part, but or the other one was what blink like hella twice, fast? Twice the normal rate. Or let's say three times, because I feel like twice is not as much if you really don't blink that much. No, but if you gotta if you gotta constantly mm. blink or every five minutes, mm. I would say <laughs> <laughs> I would say five minutes. No. Only if people people <laughs> you gonna be like, you people gonna, gonna be creeped <laughs> the fuck out like yo bro. <laughs> Hey, hey this know. boy dehydrated. Hey, man, get, hey, get this boy. No. Some, get this boy some water. That boy ain't blinking in blinking. five minutes, I'm bro. Get that boy. <laughs> <laughs> but then, if you start blinking like two times uh, the normal rate, you start looking like you got a twitch and shit. Now everybody like, oh, okay. Right okay, let me try to blink a lot, but make it look normal. Okay, you ready? Let me know how strange this looks. Don't do this to me right now. No, 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 I feel like it can still look normal. Because we don't blink that all much, right? right? right. Okay, you yeah, ready? Let's go. Okay. Let's go. Everybody, she's uh, holding, composing it. She's blinking a lot. <laughs> it looks so crazy. No, it doesn't. But like, That's what I'm, I'm saying. But, like, you, you're you're only doing it for uh, a short amount of time. You're right. You know what I mean? Just right exactly. Like, so if you did that, if I if we were talking for like 20 minutes and I noticed you doing that shit, yes, I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, uh. But uh, alternatively, uh, <laughs> if you didn't blink at all, <laughs> that one time you do blink, I feel like tears are going to run down your eyes. Because <laughs> they've been the oh. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> they've been saving up. <laughs> Yo, I ran as a motherfucker. <laughs> so yo, right. hell yeah. Nah. <laughs> Every five minutes, bro. Like, yo, man, don't get a breeze going on, bro. Oh, yo, I was just fuck, no, yo. Oh, no, nah, yeah, yeah. I feel like I had a laze. It was a loose Oh, man. All right, what, two more? Ooh. All right. Oh, that was funny. Y'all let me know, man. I, I, that's a hard one. I don't even know which one I'll do, man. Either one sucks, though. Okay, let me. Do you have one? Oh, yeah. uh, man. The, my favorite one, though, uh, I was like, you know, from the last one, man. Like, yeah. yeah. My favorite one is, would you rather uh, go a week with a permanent rock in your shoe or one wet sock? That was your favorite one? Yeah, that's my favorite one. Because both of them motherfuckers, like, when you think about it, down, when you think down to it. So, like. Me, and I would like, rather... You can move this pebble around for about, like, 30 seconds or so. And then it started coming back up and hit you back up. Like, <laughs> like you're on you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I would take the rock in my shoe because I hate wet socks. Mm. It is my pet peeve. Mm. I... Yeah. Yeah. You hate wet socks. I can deal with the rock. I feel like, yeah, it's going to keep rumbling around, but I feel like I can get it at one point, you know mm-hmm. what I mean? And then, like, kind of be cool at least for, like, 30 seconds. Yeah, but, like, the yeah, West Side, there's no yeah. relief ever at all. Like, no, I'm taking the rock. <laughs> you got to take off that shoe. That one toe going to be all, like, standing up and shit. <laughs> You've been trying to adjust for a whole week, nigga. That toe is now standing up permanently, nigga. <laughs> You want to know what my favorite one was? What's up? What's up? Would you rather have no knees or no elbows? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. That's, that's a good one. That's a good one. Because, like, that sucks. I have to go no elbows. I have to go no elbows. Like, you know. So you can sit down and bend your knees? Mm-hmm. Like, sit down. I can bend my knees. I can still jump. I can run. Like, you know. Still be mobile. Yeah. Have no desire to just be looking like this all day. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, yo, I, like, I, will, gotta, I will not hold my arms like, all like, day. What you, what you <laughs> mean? Like, do we got to go I around can, in the Jesus pose? Uh, or like, you know what I'm saying? Or, but you saying no elbows. I, I just keep them down to the side, right? Like, like, I ain't got to go out. Mm-hmm. No knees, though? How are you going to get around? I don't know. <laughs> yo, 
I'm going Yo, to. Yo, you're going to be like, you're going to be causing so listen, much like backup for listen, shit. Like, I just yo, want like, you to, listen. <laughs> Dear, I may look like I have a disability. People will be like, oh, this is a disability. Like, man, oh, man, out, you like, shit, like, style, like, just straight up, but wait, arms wait. straight out. I said no like, elbows. Now you saying no shoulders, though. So oh, that's what I guess like, so. Yeah, that's I what I'm saying. saying. Like, like, we in a Jesus pose or not? Like, like, you're saying, like, like, I don't have no elbows, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> in my mind, this right? Like, you just gotta walk around like this, like, you ain't got no elbows, bro. I guess you, like, you, have, you have some you buff ass shoulders. shoulders. You have some buff ass shoulders. You walk around like that, like you know what I'm saying, like for real. That's right, 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 right. But yeah, nah, like yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'll keep my arms down to the side, like you know. Oh, like, you know I change my mind too. I yeah, no yeah, man, no elbows, man. Like I'm like I can still shoot free throws. It's gonna be awkward, but I can still. How you gonna beat the knees though? <laughs> 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 you know what I'm saying? This wrist game is gonna be on point. You know what I'm saying? Like, what's okay. good? Do we got one more? Let's get let's find one more like random. Game. All right, one more. Mm-hmm. Before we get up out of here. Okay, okay, okay. Would you rather be covered in fur or covered in scales? Fur on top. Oh, oh, <laughs> just thinking about that. Like, oh, in scales. Oh, God. Oh, Why man, I'd you be a... fish scales. We talking about fish scales, right? Fish scales. Like, what kind of fish scales? Like, you can be like reptiles or like. Oh, oh, get that shit the fuck off like, of like, me, dog. I'm thinking about like a lizard. I wouldn't mind being like a lizard or like an iguana. <laughs> I wouldn't mind. <laughs> No, I get that. The only reason why I would, like, pick fur was I'm thinking about that. I'm thinking about that. I feel you. I'm thinking about, um, um, you remember that uh, Fair Factor episode when they had to, like, lay in the container? And oh. they, like, pour all the buds. Oh. I'm thinking about somebody oh. pouring, like, fish scales on me. Like, oh! Ugh. Like, I think, like, fit, like, all right, reptile, sc- reptile scales, I can do. Because they dry. Thinking about fish scales, like the little bit of slime, like you ever been fishing? Like, wait, wait, wait. To... are you thinking about being covered in it? Yeah, like, yeah. What, what was you talking about? What, like, wait, what's the question? Skin, dog. No? I was thinking. Oh, like... add skin. Wait, oh, wait, what? Let me read the question. Oh, okay, okay. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, okay, I'm, I'm rather, confused. Would you rather be covered in it? No, I was thinking about that skin. Oh, covered in it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ugh. That's what I'm saying. I'm like, that's why I was like, I'm thinking about Fear Factor and like, you know, it's they like, pouring that shit over you and shit. It's like, like, who's her? <laughs> that's what I'm going to know. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good question. That's uh, a good question. <laughs> New that, York that, sewer rat. That sounds nasty. <laughs> the New York. I would definitely take the scales. Cambodian. Scales. <laughs> I'm taking the scales at that point. Like, I don't. I don't trust all of this. Hell no, dog. Like, even if it was like human hair, I think I would be taking it. Yo, scale man, that's what, that's what I'm saying. But nah, but skip, like, like, what if it was fish scales, though? Like, you know what I mean? With a little bit of the, the fish oil, like, you know what I'm saying? That comes. Like, if you ever went fishing, like, you, you know. Huh? You are an expert. Like, you said scales, though. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, scales or, like, you know, rapper. Nah, like, you know what I'm saying? That's, but, like, you think scales are. You think they're hard or you think they're it like when you when, like when you like grab a fish from the hook, it is the slimiest like oh ah, like that's what I was imagining like fish scales like oh oh <laughs> yeah I can't I, I, I don't know but I like, think I would take first too covered in it but if I had to have my own I guess I probably would still choose fur again just because I'm a big what fan. is this mangy dog fur like. <laughs> mangy. Like those, like the, the street dogs that got like all types of. Uh, well, I mean that's the territory they're having first. You know, sometimes it's clean, sometimes it's yeah, nasty. Yeah. Oh, keep your dog from me, dog. Like, <laughs> 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 you know what I'm saying? Like, oh my gosh. So, yo, man. Uh, what's going on? Like, uh, we are about to get up out of here. Is there anything you want to go ahead and leave the people with? Uh, any last words? Uh, any more promotion or? I don't know if I'm saying it right. Promos? Huh. Yeah, promos you got? Anything you want to drop for the people? Mm-hmm. I don't have any promos, but uh, I don't recommend eating raw Shout meat. Uh, soy juice. 
um, I think it's like most people. Um, stinky super shit. Definitely. Oh wait, actually I did have a Pokemon. Um, so my sister also does custom, um, like anything basically, like shirts, like trays, uh, like mugs, all kinds of stuff. Dope. Um, her Instagram is Kells of All Crafts, so that's Kells with a Z, and then of All Crafts with a Z. Um, so check her out, she's really dope, and, uh, yeah. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Well, yo, man, go check out the website once again, rwrsnetwork.com. And please go check out the actual network, you know, the people that we vibe with. Like, you know, I went through the list of people, you know, uh, Hustle Yard Media, I Am Root Co., uh, <clears throat> Your Local Savior, Rumor Has a Peril, Stinky Hippie, you know. Um, inspired by Kiki. Inspired by Kiki, Mr. Get Right. Like, you know, we out here vibing, man. We, uh, we moving as a collective, you know what I'm saying? We're going to make this happen for everybody out here. We getting started with the uh, playlist song, like, you know, I think we might just go ahead and pop it off for the New Year's, you know what I'm saying? So, like, don't don't trip, like, I know y'all been submitting y'all music and everything, but we are about to get uh, that right, and we about to get that back popping, so, you know, y'all be on the lookout for that. <clears throat> um, Francisco Phoenix, man, go check me out on all platforms, man, I got a new single about to come out, Hot five, you know what I'm saying? Stop the stupid, you know, y'all go uh, download or, you know, yeah, download that, man. First 50 people to download that gets a free t-shirt, man. So, yo, please go ahead, support, man, like, you know, and let's get to it. Any Anything else? Yeah, just follow me at Stinky Hippie, that's Stinky with an I-E, and Hippie with an I. All right, man, yo, the Rolling Stones, we about here. Adios. Peace, peace. Yeah.